never one to be beaten. Let's do this. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord who made heaven and earth. And let's have a moment of reflection to think about the day we've had and the day that will follow. Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do our sins heal us by your spirit and raise us to new life in Christ Amen O God make speed to save us O Lord make haste to help us glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Before the ending of the day, creator of the world, we pray with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. From evil dreams defend our sight. Through fears and terrors of the night, tremble, no sinful thought may know. O Father, that we ask be done, through Jesus Christ, your only Son, and by whose breath our souls are raised to life from death. I had intended to share Psalm 27 this evening, but in lieu of the internet connection, I'll share something shorter, Psalm, Psalm 134. Come bless the Lord, all you servants of the Lord, you that by night stand in the house of the Lord. Lift up your hands towards the sanctuary and bless the Lord. The Lord who made heaven and earth give you blessing out of Zion. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the is now and shall be forever. Amen. You, O Lord, are in the midst of and we are called by your name. Leave us not, O Lord our God. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people. A light to reveal you to the nations of your people Israel. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning is now Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking, 
and guard us while sleeping, that we may watch with Christ and asleep may rest in peace. And today's prayer for the day. Lord God, your son left the riches of heaven and became poor for our sake. When we save us from pride, when we are needy, save us from despair, that we may trust in you alone, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us and guard us in peace, and may your blessing be always upon us. Through Jesus Christ, amen. And so our Saviour, as our Saviour taught so let us pray together. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from for the kingdom the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus. For the night is at and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. Come with the dawning of the day and make yourself known in the breaking of the bread. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face to shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us on us and give us peace. Amen. dear no ideas why this is happening but thank you for staying with us we hope you've had a fab weekend and wish you all a wonderful week have a great evening night night <laughs>